multidisciplinarity is a key issue in gastrointestinal cancer, but in all type of uh, cancers. But uh, specifically here, we are used to multidisciplinary meetings to discuss patients with localized disease. But this is now, and, uh, in the last few years, expanding to advanced disease. In colorectal cancer, uh, we have several line, lines of therapy. Uh, we can control um, a disease during an prolo a more prolonged period of time, and also making a personalized type of precision approach. So innovation is coming to treatment of advanced colorectal cancer by getting better defined subtypes with a specific treatments in, in all of them. And also we have some hope on the new RAS inhibitors, not only uh, G12C, but also some other new compounds that could tackle on a higher proportion of patients with uh, advanced colorectal cancer. So we have several compounds, several trials, all of them giving positive results. Uh, for gastroesophageal cancer, the introduction of immunotherapy with checkpoint inhibitors has been a very important step forward in the management of these disease. Because for the first time, median overall survival in most trials was above one year. And this was not happening with previous trials when only chemotherapy was used. And also, uh, there is a big uh, uh, activity around innovation in um, cholangiocarcinoma, where several molecular subtypes are also recognized. And of course, in pancreatic cancer, very difficult disease, but a lot of efforts trying to improve outcomes. So this is why the area of gastrointestinal cancer is calling a lot of uh, attention uh, because uh, many innovative uh, uh, publications are coming into the field. Multidisciplinarity is key not only in the management of localized disease, where traditionally uh, surgeons, radiation oncologists, uh, and medical oncologists, even uh, gastrointestinal specialists are involved, but even in metastatic disease. The other point is on precision medicine, on those molecular subgroups that are making us to recognize very different type of diseases. So, being educated also in the advances of parallel areas like surgery, radiation, interventional uh, radiology, molecular pathology is going to bring together a um, number, I mean, a body of knowledge that is going to shape the optimal future practice for gastrointestinal oncology. Mm -hmm.